Uh, standing behind me is a forage cart, DT30. Uh, the 30 represents the tonnage that it can uh, hold. And uh, the thought process behind this device is to keep semi tractors and trucks out of the field. Uh, you will be able to note later that uh, this unit is on a track system from Camel Track and it reduces compaction by up to 60% over a semi tire. And uh, so with the idea of following the chopper, offloading into the cart, and then chasing it to the edge of the field, and then offloading it into the semi-trailer, I like to uh, paint the picture for people that uh, are not seeing it, uh, that it is a cousin to the grain cart. And uh, we know what uh, that has done in the industry to help speed up um, harvest. Um, the floor is activated by a PTO shaft. Uh, the beater system and the conveyor is all hydraulically uh, driven. No surprise on the name brand there that is uh, recognized uh, through the industry as one of the leaders in track manufacturers and uh, that is by Camoplast. Uh, the unit also has a five-point measuring weigh scale by agro scale and they're just again based on the same concept that we use with grain carts today and uh, there's four um, points here on the box and then there is one point uh, in the tongue and uh, then if a grower needs to be able to uh, record per field what they're doing uh, they can get a printout in the cab. Uh, the conveyor, uh, four foot wide, uh, with the proper hydraulics on a tractor, we like to see around uh, 55 to 60 gallons per minute. We can unload 30 ton into a semi-trailer in right around three minutes. Thanks for your time.